I feel like I need Maracas. We're in Notting Hill. It's not Carnival, but I do want to celebrate the fact that this property still looks the same as it did the day we returned the keys to the client. The client, a professional American couple, relocated to the UK a number of years ago and had been renting this property. They decided to buy it and to reimagine the spaces. They engaged our company to do just that. Sustainability was really important to our client. They wanted us to source and produce as many of the pieces of ff &E that you see in the property locally here in the UK. They also wanted us to engage local craftspeople and joiners to create the many beautiful pieces of joinery you see dotted around the property. The client hadn't heard of the term joinery pack when they started this project and I think it's a term they'd rather forget. There were a lot of intricate details in the joinery and we worked with the joiners to create prototypes to illustrate the details uh, for our client meetings. This, for example, is the natural oak with the maple trim uh, with the correct, correct thickness of the shelf um, to demonstrate how the finished piece was going to look. We then worked with local French polishers to create a range of stains before landing on the ones that we liked. We then created another prototype showing that stain and the maple trim detail accompanied by this wonderful Philip Jeffries wallpaper to add some texture and depth to the back of the shelves. We looked to art to find a way of referencing the client's Indian cultural background. Beside me we have uh, two female uh, Indian artists represented on the walls um, we had bespoke frames made for the pieces to tie them into the joinery that you see throughout the property. Uh, it's nice to have those personal touches and to go through uh, an art procurement process with the client. Working with a client that was as detailed oriented as I am uh, was both a pain and a pleasure. Uh, read OCD. Um, it's really the details that make a big difference when bringing a scheme to life. So here, the frame that we have used to box in the TV and the speaker, the acoustic panels, picks up on the profile details of the joinery. We then mirrored the same size profiles in marble to trim the biethanol fireplace. And again, it's details like the shadow gap on the joinery continuing seamlessly onto the shadow gaps throughout the property that bring the scheme to life and show that it has been considered at every point. This was a fun commission. We turned to local artisan Avine Daly to create this piece. Uh, the peacock is the national bird of India and is a symbol of pride, grace and beauty, much like the client's designer. Um, we worked closely with Avine to curate a collection of dyed and natural uh, peacock feathers to create this wonderful uh, piece. Avine also helped us to create this pattern of uh, metallic beads reminiscent of Indian architecture. And I think it really helps lift the leading edge of these curtains.